All right, today I'm going to show you um, how to download reshade or Bisky shaders for us to make your game look better. And um, before we start, Windows 10, it might bug out sometimes and it might not work as well. And it just won't flat out won't load. But for Windows 11, it works 100% of the time. There's no bugs. So to start this, just load up Google, search up reshade.me, or just search up reshade, and just get to this website. I'll have this website in the description and just click download. You click download, just it's gonna bring you down here and you're gonna download Reshade 6.0.1, basically just the newest version. Um when you download it, uh run the app and just search up Rust client.exe. Make sure it's Rust client, not Rust. Then click next. Make sure you click 10, 11, 12 DirectX not just 9, it needs to be 10, 11, 12. Click next, and you're going to want to uncheck all, and then check all, and then next. Now this is just going to load, depending on how fast your computer is, it should load pretty fast, but let it load. Alright, once it's loaded in, just click finish. You're not going to be seeing that again, so I'm just going to be closing this off, and I'm going to be checking if I actually downloaded it, if it's actually loaded into Rust. I'm not putting any shaders in, though, currently. We're going to do that after. When you load into Rust, it's going to pop up a big bar on the top of your screen and say it's loading in Reshade, just like that. Now what it's going to want you to do is, it's going to want you to do function home. I use a 60% keyboard, I need to press home function. Um, but other keyboards, it's just a home key. But to open up the menu, I'm going to be pressing function home. And it's going to have a tutorial. You can do the tutorial, but uh, there is really no point. And I'll just teach you how to do it anyways. So do skip tutorial. Now you have this open. and. You could just do function home, close it off, and I'm just going to quit Rust real quick because I'm going to be loading in actual files. So I'm going to have these files in the description. These are the day shaders. These are the night shaders. For night, you could see better, but with the new force wipe, it doesn't really matter. And these are the graphic settings that look really nice. So this will be in the description. Make sure you download both of, download both of them and put it to your desktop. I already have them both here. You're going to open up File Explorer, and you're going to scroll down to Windows. Make sure it's your hard drive. Make sure it's this. It has to be this. And you're going to make a new folder. So you're going to right-click here, New Folder, and just name it Reshade. Make sure it's a capital. You can now open this up, and I'm just going to drag this over like this. And I'm going to take both of these files and drag them into there. I'm going to drag day first and night second. As you can see, they're both in here now. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to just control C. You're going to click this on top and control C. I'll put this in the description too. Copy and paste that. And we're now going to want to load in Rust again. You could close that. We're saving the file name so we could paste it in into Reshade. Alright, now that we're loading in, it's going to again show up this, and it's going to tell you to click home every single time. Just remember, function home. And after that, once your game is loaded in, I do function home, open it up, and then right here, next to these arrows, and next to this, and between those, you're just going to paste in you're going to do control a on this message right here and you're going to paste in what i told you to paste in and just click enter now you could click whatever shader you want so these are the day shaders click on day and just click select and now it's loaded in as you can see the game looks way brighter now nicer and if it is a little too bright just go straight to nvidia control panel and just turn the digital brightness a little lower and make it your preference. And again, I'll show you. It will load up like this if you want to turn the light shaders. 
click here and select night reshade preset and click select see now it's all bright for you to be able to see it <laughs> all right i'm just gonna now show you how to uninstall it if you don't want it so to uninstall it it's way quicker and you're gonna keep rust open you're just gonna go to your file i already have it open here and i'm you're just gonna go to your to your downloads reshade setup right here and you're again just gonna search up rust client next click 10 11 12 next and then click uninstall and then just click next and it's gonna uninstall you for you and then you don't have to do anything else and that's it hope you guys enjoyed bye, -bye.